Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Timberborn. So in the previous ones we've done quite a bit already and um, to continue our series, let me just bring back the UI real quick. We are going to um, redo our production. I know we had a couple of buildings in here, it may seem like a bit of a waste, but um, I've finally figured out what exactly I do want to do. I did show a little bit in the previous episode I believe. And um, yeah, I've queued up a couple more things. So let's bring up the blueprints. So we've uh, expanded this um, zone here essentially. And the power is going to come through this uh, river right behind. I was initially thinking of potentially using this as the, as the water wheels area. And then bringing through some cables to run it up the hill. But I think we're, we're not going to do that. We're going to use this area for something else and... Uh, yeah, this episode is not about that. We'll do it in one of the future ones, but for the time being, let's get this area built up. We'll get some power going through as well. And uh, yeah, the idea is really to get this, uh, um, get some metal being made because we do want more metal, metal blocks uh, to build the explosives factory. Yeah, and then we can start making canals and all sorts of fun stuff. So let's just see how can our beavers get there. So problem number one is we don't really have reach. And to solve that, we are gonna... Let me just remove a couple of trees real quick. I think that should be enough. And then let's give you a high priority as well. Cool, let's unpause everything. Water I know is a little bit low. But they shall be starting to fill this up very shortly. So right, uh, coming back to the reach, the district center can reach only about here. So to solve this, um, we don't really use this area. Uh, if we reorientate the map uh, right behind us, yeah, that's not really being used. It seems all our building is, well, at least right now, is hap happening on the south side of the of the of the river. So what we'll do simple solution we're just gonna move the district center over and as soon as they're empty which this one already is another water tank is empty and so is this one okay awesome can we just please prioritize the other trees as well uh, points wise 1500 so i think another thing we'll probably do is let's slap another monument down oh that's gonna take a thousand points but that is okay monument goes there are we paused right now? We are. District center comes off. And where is the... Yep, a new one is here. Okay, let's put a few beavers working in here. And we had a 50 unemployed ones, but they're just quickly going to reassign themselves. And off we go. Yeah, that's, that's good. Do we need some more power in here? Nope. Oh, they're full. Well, in that case... Please start building those um, platforms. No, platforms, please. Yep. Good. Ooh, we're going to need some gears as well, don't we? And uh, let's bring a road uh, somewhere here. Oh, we are going to need another platform. That's okay. One in there will give you a slightly higher priority. Get these built first. And I think... Uh, <laughs> Ah, uh, you know what, let's just bring the road through. Uh, so now if we check the reach... Yeah, it's just orange over here, or about to get orange. So we can definitely go down here and further improve our plans. But okay, uh, I think we are also going to need some gear, so why don't we open about two of them. Um, temporary solution. Water... Yeah, water... Hmm... Well, we've got four bumps right now. So we should be able to build this up fairly quickly. Do we have... Yes, we do have. Maybe we'll prioritize you as well. Just start carrying the water if you can, please. Think with the rest. Oh, okay. We've got three beavers because this area for some reason is flooded there. So let's have more builders. And for temporary location, we're just going to use this area right over here you know what we're just gonna pause you as well yeah since we can't use it 
Okay, maybe we'll speed it up just a little bit more. Carrots is a bit low. Let's see what's our reach again. Can we... Uh, we can, and I think we shall. Uh, more carrots down here would be nice. Maybe that's something we can do straight away. Facing which way? This way? No. This is fine. And that could be a small priority as well. And now this means we can put carrots literally throughout this whole area. I know when the drought comes it's gonna be unusable land. But, you know, if, if we can get a few harvest, harvest through here then uh, we're pretty happy. Let's go back and see how our gears... Yeah, we got some gears, we got some planks. Uh, you know what, let's just unpause you. We can have a few extra builders. I think we'll just pause you for the time being. Uh, okay, so water number E numbers are going slowly up. So that's good. I uh, would like to in the future expand this a little bit more. I think another, maybe even a bigger warehouse over here. And just to build on top of them and a few more water pumps. But for now... I think we should be able to survive. Right, beaver numbers 56 is quite okay for us for for a little bit of time. We will be increasing that, but we are just gonna wait for this area to be built up a little further. Okay, could use a few farmers there, but... Are you guys very busy here? Two farms, oh, they should be alright. I'll just leave them be for the for the time being. Okay, we do have another drought coming in. In about 2.5 days. So, <laughs> let's see, how are you guys going? Can we have these things built, please? Oh, we need to get up there, of course, absolutely. So, how about putting another set of stairs? Just over there. Let's just check. Yeah, that's a cute amount of water there. Right. Uh, we've got a few, let's see, power shafts in place. We just need... Do we need this straight away? We do. Scrap metal. we got scrap metal. I did want to put, put a tree in here. However... Yeah, it's not going to be able to reach. That's fine. I'm not going to pause this. Let's have them built. Can we have this section here as well? So we could start bringing, bringing through some power. Okay, that's being constructed. Wonderful. This section next. Actually, let's give it a high priority. And what we'll be missing is a T-junction. Okay, we can unpause this wheel as well. I know this power isn't going to last very long, but uh, hey, if we can just squeeze a little bit out of it, that's already going to be good. 1.4 days. Ooh. Okay. Um, another thing I do want to do is I want to create some artificial power. And what I mean by that is... Let's see. Yep, over here is that we are going to use some water dumps. Oh, we just first have to research them. And we are going to place maybe like four in this area. And in down here, we are going to do a few water pumps. So anything they bump, we're going to drop it in here. And that way we'll keep the water wheels running as well. I might change this to a separate district, to be honest. But we'll, we'll see how it goes. But that's essentially the plan. I think what we'll do is, since that is not our top priority just yet, we'll have these links built first. You've got the ingredients. Can someone please build this? Okay, here we go. Blanks. Okay, we are a little short, so maybe we should bring this power down. Uh, <laughs> Yep, so I'm going to use one of those row houses just to transfer the power straight down since we do have a lot of logs. We're not going to have beavers living here. 
Although we might actually. Yeah, we just might. Um, seems our population has gone over the what we can support. So we do have to fix this as well. So I suppose temporarily we could even use that. Oh, we can't build them just yet. Well, we can put the resources in. And that should be our priority. Just a few more few more planks and we're almost done with that. Oh, wait. Let's close you up. Don't want to lose any water. Uh, I think we lost a little bit, but that is okay. Yeah, we'll be fine. Plus, that is full now anyway, so maybe we can pause one. And potentially the one beaver could go into, into making some metal. Few children almost ready as well. How about this statue? Okay, we are starting to get some more resources in here, halfway through. So that is looking, looking good. Let me just try and remind myself what is the bonus. Working speed, uh, speed plus 25%. Now, that's definitely nothing to complain about. We'll definitely take it. And once we get this blanks... Um, production going as well then I think we're we'll move up to the next bonuses too let's just quickly check what else can we do that's easy um <laughs> uh, wheat bread yeah that's definitely something we do we should focus maybe in the next video then pretty good uh, that's gonna give them more walking speed hmm fun uh, spirituality actually is not too bad either. What does this require? It requires 120 logs. Yeah, we got plenty of those. And 40 planks. We could have one down somewhere in the middle. Maybe in the middle of the forest would be would be pretty nice. But I think uh, let's just check how many points do you need? 300. Oh, that's nothing. Yeah. So perhaps that's the next thing. Pretty easy bonus to get. So we've got the first statue up. Uh, sorry, I mean the monument. So that's good. It's right next to the housing units. And pretty sure, yeah, all three of them are receiving those bonuses. So that's wonderful. And also some of those workplaces here. So absolutely beautiful. Okay, so since there's no more water here, I think we'll just close you up. And... Let's see. Oh, we don't have any spare beavers. This He's going to require some beaver power. And you cannot operate because there's no power. Fair enough. So maybe we'll have to just reallocate some beavers. Alright, so the next step really to get some power through is to remove some of those roads. Now we need a water pump right in there. And if we want to have another one, then... A platform is needed. Okay. Let's have these built. We need to go up there as well. And maybe we can drop this down a little bit. Yeah, I don't want them to... Empty our water reserve. So maybe we do have to make this into a separate district. Would be smarter, I think. Yeah, we could just remove the link somewhere here and put a district gate in there instead. Yeah, this could go... Yeah, that should not be a problem at all. Alright, another night and we got another 14 days. Now that's a pretty long drought. How much water have we lost so far in the three days? About one, one level, roughly. I believe so, isn't it? Yeah, it's just about above uh, one... Or below one, should I say. And all this land in here that's underneath the water. Now that's definitely something we'll... Let's, can we unlock dynamite? Yes, we can. So in the future, I do want to get uh, rid of all this. So then we can hold even more water inside there. I think we'll... Yeah, we're going to have to put some ladders down then. We'll figure it out. Okay, so this one's working now as well great but we are gonna need you to be done oh, you are high priority we're just lacking 
some planks. Uh, do we still need gears? Probably be a higher priority as well, so they can get up here. No, I don't think we need more gears. Although, we could use another link just to finish this connection here. And since we have... Oh, wow, so many logs. We're going to start opening a um, few more water wheels. Okay, maybe we'll put you down to 16 hours again. Give those busy beavers a bit of extra extra rest. I mean, they do deserve it. They've, they've built quite a few things for us so far, so yeah. Okay, another water wheel is going in. Are we... Okay, so we have received some blanks. Just a little bit more. Can we give you maybe even higher priority? You know what? Let's let's just do it. And then I'd like to get rid of those trees up here. Uh, let's just see. 12.5 days. That is not bad. We've got a thousand logs in store. So I'm thinking... Maybe we'll take another beaver out. Food-wise, carrots are starting to improve. Can we tell you... Plant carrots. That should be our pri priority. And then I think in the future as well. I'm just going to deprioritize these stairs in here. But we are going to bring this road in. Something like so. Which means we can have even more carrots. Okay, just one more ladder needed. Three more blanks. I think I saw one. I'll pause the gears. Not sure where they're taking them right now. I thought we're, we've already used up all the gears we need. Oh, they're putting them in the explosives factory. And uh, same with planks as well. Now, it's it, it can wait. It's fine. Alright, they're moving up now. So let's unpause another, give you the higher priority, and you, just the normal. Once these are in, we'll allocate some beavers to work in here. Let's give you just slightly above a, a normal priority. And yeah, those log piles are already full. I think we don't need this many lumberjacks, so let's cut them down. We've got a lot of resources already. Beaver numbers are going up. We got a few homeless beavers, but as soon as this house is done, uh, I think about what is it? Oh, five. Okay, so one is still gonna be homeless, unfortunately. But we are almost there. Uh, building isn't connected. Um, hmm. <laughs> oh, right. We're just missing this corner here. No, it's this one. And it's boss. That's why. Okay. Uh, we've got six wheels in now that's not bad at all and someone started to devour this little forest in here how far are the water dumps we just need one more plank oh they're just taking their logs in okay gotcha maybe you can do this one first dead more days left for the before we get the rainy season again and yeah okay so we're slightly below one line now so that was seven days. Okay. That's good to know. That's not bad at all, actually, with a colony of 64 beavers. And I see someone bringing up blanks. That should be our first. Yep. We've got the water dump in. And let's see how this is going to work. If it's going to work at all. I do think we're going to need slightly larger volume in here. But once they get those built, how much water do you have? Okay, so that's good. We could do one more water pump later on. Yeah, maybe we need a couple more. All right, so the beavers are back at work, bringing in some extra water. They should be picking it from here. Because that's the closest. Let's just follow one of the one of the staff. Uh, why, why are you going all the way there? I'm not sure there is water in here. Let's just check again. Ah, oh, you're just sitting there. Ah, uh, is the building full? Not sure. Okay, so we got a little bit more water in here. Let's see if we can get those wheels spinning. So that way we could have this shredder 
working there. I suppose once we get the last one running as well, maybe. Uh, <laughs> oh no, it all evaporated. Ah, uh, well, once we get the fourth one up, let's see how it's gonna work then. I'm not gonna give up. Maybe we just need more water water dumps. Just wanna see how many beavers do we actually need to have in them. So let me just pause the last ones. Get one more working, and it's staffed now as well. Where are you, good sir? Just chilling out. Why, you could be bringing in some more water. And come on, let's get those wheels spinning. Just a bit more water. Yeah, I think we're going to need a few more. Okay, we've got power. That's awesome. Uh, it didn't last very long, but at least we we do have some power now. Yeah, it seems to be evaporating rather quickly. So I have a feeling we're just wasting water right now. I wonder how this evaporation system works. Is it that it evaporates into the air every uh, half a half a tile every ten days, or, or right now it seems to be that the land itself was actually just disappearing into into the land in here because it's so dry. Well, that would be interesting to know. Uh, anyway, six point eight days left until we get those wheels spinning again without needing those water tumps. But I just want to give it a give it a try. See if we can make it work. Okay, I think you you can leave this post. Ah, uh, forgot to check if there was any trees in there. Oh well it's fine. We've got plenty of logs. Not too worried about it. And the shredder is um working. We've got some metal just a little bit. I think that's gonna go into the explosives factory could please have some cares in there as well. So this means maybe we'll stop building this up actually. Alright, so I've let it run for a little bit and it just seems that water evaporates so quickly in here. We're barely able to fill this up with a little bit of water, just enough to get one of those wheels spinning. But then when it gets to nighttime, the water just disappears. So yeah, it just feels like we're wasting it. But then at the same time, four days, never mind. We'll let it run. We've got quite a few water pumps running, so we might as well. I mean, it's not like we're short of water yet. There's plenty over there. I think what we'll also do is, well, let's try and drop some water. Ooh, is that level too low? No, it is not. Just want to have a little bit more water inside this section. Just a quick little top up and I think we are fine now. Put it back on level 2. Right, so if we look at this now, it's evening. Those beavers are going to go home. They've stocked it up with water. Well, some of them at least. Right, and any second now this water typically disappears. And that's that's a bit of a shame. Let's see if it happens this night as well. Okay, so maybe we managed to get enough water. Oh, okay. So that's good. In any previous night, it just seemed to disappear. I think what will also be smarter is if we had some dedicated haulers working on this section to bring water in. What it seems like is that as soon as the beaver leaves the house, it stops... Yeah, look at this. Okay, so where's the beaver? He's bringing water, but whilst they're away, the water dump itself is not working. Well, that means we are gonna need a hauling post here. Do we have planks? Not really. Yeah, it's just... Ah, uh, there you go. All that water just disappeared. Um, And that just feels so beaver-heavy system over here. We've got six in the dumps, two in the bumps, and that's eight. And I guess we could do like six water carriers as well. That is 12, 14 beavers just to get power. Is it worth it? I I don't know. I mean, if it powers everything in here, then potentially. But then we might as well build... Where is it? Power the engine. If we built... Let's say 10 engines, that's 2,000 horsepower. That should power 
power most of the buildings in here and plus it's using logs which we we just have a whole whole lot a uh, lot in our storage storage units um so yeah although it's fun little experiment i just don't think the numbers really work out plus in the middle of a trout yeah i don't know how much i like taking all this water out and yeah uh, all that water just disappeared again so maybe it's not the best solution and we could barely get one of one or two of those water wheels working as well so uh yeah well we've got the hauling post in now and a couple of beavers working here let's just put an extra one let's see if we are constantly uh maybe we'll put them on a priority as well let's see all of them the fifth one oh and last one so those beavers oh he's already gone who knows where We've got some more beavers transporting water does that mean yep he's sitting in four of them are working and now they're all gone should be stocked up with the water when another day starts and we've lost all the progress uh not ideal okay i think we're gonna unpause the rest of the buildings here and we'll probably start building the rest as well we just need some more planks so let's get some power in the trout is almost over just the tail left and then we can get some more more blanks being made for us i'll just let it run for a little bit more maybe today we'll get them working oh that was close nearly there come on beavers okay so a little bit of power coming through that is looking much better yeah, definitely need more pumps helping us out in here. And it does seem it's coming down, but it's just not high enough, it seems. I mean, there is a bit of a drop. Maybe it's... No, it shouldn't be better. Maybe it is better if it was. The drop was just behind the wheels. But then here, it's not really flowing anywhere. Well, it was a fun experiment. But now that the drought is over... We can pause them and use those beavers elsewhere. Elsewhere, And here comes the water. We should have a constant or a steady supply of power. Ooh, it's not going to be down here. So we don't need those buildings operational. We are going to need you though. And the things we're lacking in are metal blocks and gears. Yeah, so maybe we do need a temporary... Uh, solution to let some power through because building two of them is just gonna take a bit of time but yeah what are you waiting for you are waiting for scrap metal oh because you've gone through all of it okay so we're gonna have to go getting some uh, scrap metal i think we'll devour probably that one for sure and uh, at least some of it as well if not all but we are gonna do it in one of our future episodes so thank you very much for joining in this time and uh, i hope to see you again in the next one